Yo, what up everybody? It's your boy Revive Me. Today I'm going to show you how to install textures and how to load them inside your emulator on XBSX2 for the Xbox. So first you need to find some texture packs from Google. I'm just going to show you an example of how to install them. So first, um, the example I'm going to use is for Naruto Ultimate Ninja 3. I have a video on this with the install link in the description. So once you download this, you're going to get a zip folder that looks just like this. Double click on it, should pop up WinRAR, and you should see these uh, this folder with the SLUS code. This is the specific SLUS code for Naruto Ultimate Ninja 3. It has to be the specific one for the emulator to register it and for it to work. But once you have this, plug in your USB storage device and make a folder for the textures. So for me, I have PlayStation 2 textures, and inside of it, I have multiple packs but once you make that folder and you have the zip file for the textures all you got to do is drag and drop right into it i already have this so i definitely don't need it again but once you do that that's pretty much it and then from there we go straight back to the xbox so let's head right over to the xbox Alright, now that we're back to the Xbox, make sure your USB is plugged in, go to your settings, go to the last tab all the way to the right, and from here, alright, once, alright, once we're done, we're... alright, once we open up the emulator and we're back, make sure your USB device is plugged in, go down to settings, go all the way to the second tab from the right, All right, once we're back on the emulator and you have USB plugged in, go to your settings, go all the way to the end of the right side tabs. Second to last one should say directory configuration. Go all the way down, look for textures, click A on it, go to parent directory, click. All right, once we're back on the emulator and you have everything plugged into your Xbox, go down to settings. Click right bumper till you get to the second to last on the right side tabs. It should say directory settings. Go all the way down to the bottom. Click A on textures. Click A on parent directory a couple times until you see these drives. Mine is in the D drive, so I'm going to click it. Go to my files. Look for my PS2 textures folder. Click on it. And then click use this directory. And from there, anytime you add texture packs to your USB device, it should already be set up in your directory for XBSX. So you shouldn't have to go through this process again. And then the final and last step is uh, head over to the advanced settings. Go all the way down and you should see load textures. Make sure this is enabled. And if this is enabled, it should load as soon as you start your game. 